like to say the two great, well, there's a saying, I didn't make it up, but I, <laughs> I like to say it. Um, the two greatest days of your life is the day that you're born and the day that you find out you died, okay? Don't quote me because that is not my quote. <laughs> um, but when you know your why, your what, and the how, and the when becomes easier. Um, and so I tell people, and can I tell this story? Sure. Okay. Okay. So John Maxwell is one of my favorite authors. Um, and so he has a story in one of his books about the bricklayers. There were three bricklayers. Anyone heard of that one? No, good, okay. So, <laughs> so the first, there, there was a gentleman and he was walking down the street and he went to the first bricklayer and he said, what are you doing? He said, oh, I'm laying a brick. Okay, so he went a little further and he went to the second bricklayer and he said, what are you doing? He said, I'm building a wall. And so he went to the third bricklayer and he said, what are you doing? He said, I'm building a cathedral. So the first person had a job, the second person had a career, and the third person had a calling. So when you look at your, your vision and your purpose, it's really bigger than what you, get, what you look at, you have to be able to see. And one of the differences between looking at a vision or, and seeing it is different. So when I have a 17 year old son, he's the last of, last of the Mohicans, thank God, he's right when he's there. <laughs> and, and so, poor boys, okay. And so I like to say when, you know, it could be typical for men, but I won't say that. So I, I'll tell him, go in the truck and, and uh, get my bag. Okay, so he goes in the truck. I didn't see, I didn't, I didn't find it, I didn't see it. <laughs> now, when I say go into my purse and get $50, he looks and he sees it, right? <laughs> You gotta see yourself rising above whatever circumstance. You have to see your future. So really your purpose is so intertwined with your vision, and we're talking about visionary women, that you really have to see yourself in a different way and not just look at it. You know, a visionary can see things that other people can't see. And it's not because, you know, we're smarter or, you know, we have, you know, some type of superpower. It's because 